Hello guys, Johnny M is back with episode 43 of our time lapse of Farming Simulator 17 on Mustang Valley Ranch. In the last episode, we sold all our cows. Uh, we partially transported them, partially sold uh, directly, and we bought uh, a few hundreds of new ships and a new field. Uh, it's a lot bigger than the one that we uh, already had. And since it was uh, seeded already, I went and fertilized it. But right now we had, as you saw a few seconds ago, we have a great demand for wool. We are gonna transport all this wool to the spinery and we'll sell it. And the price is one of the highest, if not the highest, that we uh, had. It's uh, something about uh, 8300 euros. So I suspect we're gonna make a lot, a lot of money. So sit back, relax and enjoy this time lapse. Okay, so I delivered all the wool to the spinery. Now it's time to wait until it will be sold. And here I'm checking the prices uh, on some equipment. First of all, we're gonna need uh, a planter to plant uh, uh, sugar beet and also we we'll need sugar beet uh, harvester and since we're gonna have more than two millions after all the wool is sold 
I will upgrade the, the sugar beet harvester right away. So um, it will be twice as fast and with twice the capacity. But of course, um, before planting, uh, sugar beet will have to harvest uh, the field that we bought in the last episode. I will unload the excess uh, grass uh, in our storage system. Still waiting for the wool to be sold. Okay, the wool have sold and we got 2.4 million euros. It's one of the highest payout, if not the highest. For some reason I'm returning to the farm. I guess uh, I will um, take the combine and deliver it to the newly bought field, but not before uh, putting some uh, gasoline or diesel, I guess. Because here I'm gonna need this combine. So uh, prepare my uh, uh, tipper train to be ready to harvest the field. And at this point I have no uh, things to do, I'm just waiting for the crop to mature. So I'm trying to find some uh, work to do. Even though I don't need water at the moment, I'll go in. Bring some. I'm constantly checking the maturity of the field. I go and refill this prayer. Because I don't have other things to do right now. I think one more growth state and the field uh, will be ready.
And it looks like the field is ready indeed. Okay, so let's now begin the harvesting of the field. So both, both of the trailers are full, as a reminder uh, the trailers are at 2x right now, so they are, are two times as big than the original one.
so while the combine is harvesting the field I decided to uh, load some straw uh, because I uh, would like right way to uh, plant uh, sugar beet Uh, but of course I don't want to lose this uh, straw um, because we're gonna need it as bedding of course um, uh, cows needed a lot more straw because um, we had to give them straw also as, as a food as one of the ingredients for their feed while uh, pigs require straw only as bedding which means that we will try to harvest as much straw as we can at, at our storage facility so that the next harvests when we will harvest uh, wheat or barley we will just leave the straw on the ground so we do the job you know good but just once at least for for the coming days I'm still trying to figure out which will be the best uh, seeder and planters I wish I could use uh, some cedars from Big Bud uh, pack, but as I explained in previous episodes, uh, I cannot unpack and modify the the DLCs. This is why I will uh, stick with the standard game equipment, which I can modify, and I need to modify them to in order to upgrade them as I do with uh, all my equipment uh, on this map so uh, yes the big bud equipment is very attractive because I uh, never used it and I would like to do it but unfortunately we will not be able to upgrade it so we'll stick with the standard equipment another full set of tippers and I had a little accident fortunately this game uh, unlike your track simulator doesn't have yet uh, a damage model implemented although you would think for so many iterations this game should have so much more features uh, and of course with uh, all these uh, new uh, games, uh, farming games uh, announced, uh, I think there will be soon a lot more uh, competition um, on, on this field. So I assume that um, soon after each of those of these games will come with a new feature. Uh, soon after all the other will uh, implement uh, uh, at least some some forms of it and I'm sure the the, the new games will have uh, uh, features that uh, FS series doesn't have so uh, giants will have to respond already we have uh, 
a response in the form of the upcoming uh, gold edition which uh, uh, let's hope we'll have some new mechanics like orchards and other things probably but I think the new games will have uh, even more features okay the recording started a little bit this uh, I think happens because of OBS or because of Premiere because we all know Premiere is not the most stable uh, software out there yes if you can and if you like you can make masterpieces with it but uh, you also have to uh, wrap your mind around all the problems that you get uh, using it Okay, so our silos are full with barley now, which means that we have to do something with the excess, so we are gonna sell it, because we were fortunate enough to have a great demand right now for barley.
Okay, so it looks like this episode is almost finished. In the next episode we will finish the harvesting and we'll plant some sugar beet because we need to uh, prepare enough food uh, just in time when we'll buy our first uh, batches of uh, pigs. So as usual, thank you for watching. If you like what you saw and want to see more, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And I will see you next time in next episode. Bye bye.